you know anybody that's better suited to become mayor in the city of Detroit, let me know. Because if not, I mean, I'm, I'm going for Dave Bing. During a campaign event for Dave Bing, former Pistons star Derek Coleman shows his support for Bing, but not just because they're former Pistons. Here's a young man who has developed, I mean, that whole North End area, which was blighted at the point in time when he started and created his business. 500 and some people over there working for him, building homes in, in, in the community where they were just raggedy abandoned, torn down homes. The city of Detroit is anxious to choose a new mayor, and Dave Bing, who considers himself not a politician, but a businessman, feels he's the right man for the job. Despite his unquestioned success as a Detroit businessman, Bing's critics call him an outsider. When Dave raised money for the school board, nobody complained about where he was from. When he built his business in the city of Detroit, nobody complained where he was from. When he built homes over there in the community where he's at now, nobody complained where he was from. But now you see when he wants to run, run for mayor, everybody wants to say, well, he's not from Detroit. As Bing attempts to transition from businessman to the next mayor, he understands it's important to gain the voters' trust. One of the things that's obviously been problematic uh, with, with the mayor's office, the former mayor, is that uh, there was a lot of misinformation. There wasn't good information in terms of people coming forward with where their financials were. And uh, I thought it was important that I did this because I really uh, don't have anything to hide. And I'm not, I'm not saying anybody else does. But I think if we can get that out in front of our public and everybody understands that uh, nobody's got you know, skeletons in their closet or hidden interests within the city of Detroit, I think that's what the voters really want to see right now as they look to pick the next mayor of the city. As the city looks to move beyond the scandals that have plagued it, voters can only hope their next choice for mayor will have the city's best interest at heart. I'm Wanta Kaufman for American Black Journal.